Hello, and welcome to another indie horror game. This time I'll be playing a game called Akai Honor, I think essentially meaning Red Woman. So, if you want to meet a lady in red, the links and the details are of course down below in the description for you, alright? This is going to be a first person horror experience where I'm going to be playing as a student who's heading home late one night when he bumps into a mysterious lady in red. I really hope you enjoy it. If you do, leave this video a like, leave your thoughts down below in the comments either way, and thank you in advance. Let's begin Akai Honor. Alright, 10.21. So, what, the 21st of October? Alright. And here we are, in control. I got home late. It's dark around here, and I need to get home soon. And this is how we get home. Presumably not this way. Okay, so we can move, interact. We've got ourselves a flashlight, alright. We can run. Crouch. And we can also see someone ahead of us. What does that say? Oh, hang on. Are we... Oh, we get a translation! Wonderful! Beware of suspicious persons. Hmm. Who is that? Is that the lady in red? It... Hmm. Whoever they are, they're heading towards me. And now I'm wondering, is home really that way? <laughs> kind of wish it was that way. Right, let's pluck up the courage to at least go around her, right? stuck to the spot. She's staring me out. She looks pretty built. She could probably take me. Right. Well, that was kind of weird. Huh. Maybe she was just checking me out, but I feel it might be a little bit more sinister than that. It is a horror game after all, right? Yeah, either way, we're heading our separate ways. Can I call Mum? <laughs> no? I don't think so. Right. Um, this way, is it? Uh, I might need my flashlight. Oh. The person from earlier. Seems pretty dangerous. I'm scared. I have to go home soon. Right. Well, hopefully home is this way. Past all these insects. Right. Oh, creepy. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> That's all I can muster. Can this be translated as well? Yeah, okay. Prohibition of illegal dumping. 10 million yen fine. Wow. Well, this is what they think of that. <laughs> they don't care about the money. Uh oh boy. Oh boy, right. Huh. Are you running to somewhere or from somewhere? Right, that was weird. Let's keep on going. This is the way home, right? I'm not being followed. I don't see any mysterious figures ahead of me. Or around the corner. So, uh, yeah. Let's just keep on going. That was weird though, wasn't it? Seems interesting so far. It reminds me a little bit of Chiller's art. Okay, well, let's hope home's to the left, because it looks like the right is not going to work. It's not the best flashlight, but I'd rather have it than not, I suppose. Seems like the street lights are doing most of the work around here, though. Still not getting followed? Okay. <laughs> Still looks pretty clear ahead. So, yeah, whereabouts am I going exactly? Are we going through this neighborhood? Do I live in this neighborhood? Maybe I've already walked past home. What about this door here? No? Hmm. Over here? No, it doesn't seem like it. Round to the right, straight on. Oh! Oh, up there? Is that where I live? Hmm. I guess so, because I think that's where we're going, right to the top floor. Alright. Up the stairs then? Yeah, let's go. Alright, so, round here. Am I going to bump into her on the stairs? I wouldn't be surprised. That would be a pretty good jump scare, to be honest. But it didn't happen. Okay, right, so, what is it, the fourth? The fourth door, right near the end. Okay, so, this is where I live? <laughs> well, this is where I'm letting myself into. Alright. 
Brilliant, we got working lights. Much better than my flashlight. The... Okay, hang on. What's this? My TV? It's my TV. Oh, that's strange. I guess I forgot to turn it off. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you did. Uh, we got a... Right, there's a light switch in here as well. That's better. Right, okay. No one can hide in the darkness now. <laughs> so, where was I? Uh, there we go. A very well-lit bathroom. With facilities that I can't use, but okay. Are we playing on the PC? No? Uh, it seems like I can use the bed. Can I maybe close the curtains? I, I, yeah. <laughs> I don't like the idea of someone peering in from the balcony. Okay, yeah, I'm tired. I'm going to bed today. <laughs> As opposed to all the other days where I don't go to bed. <laughs> and I slept for three days, too. <laughs> so the 24th now. And again, we're back here in this alleyway. Right. And there's still suspicious people around. I don't see this mysterious lady in red, not this time. Ooh. Then again, maybe I'm hearing her. <laughs> Let's get home. The hell was that for? I have to admit, this is quite unsettling. It is quite unnerving. This way, right? Oh! Wait! Oh, bloody hell. Hello. Who are you? I was the police. I am the police. The whole force. What are you doing here at this hour? Well, I'm on my way home. At this time of night? You're suspicious. But you don't seem to be lying. I can tell by the look on your face. You can see my face? Wearing your hat like that? I'm impressed. By the way, do you always go this way? I always go this way on days when I have lectures at the university. Did you go this way three days ago? Uh, I did. It, uh, why do you ask me that? <clears throat> Actually, there was a murder three days ago. The victims were a couple. The perpetrator first murdered his sleeping wife. She kills her husband. He came back after that. The body was said to have been stabbed many times and was in an unsightly state. You. Did you see anyone suspicious on your way home? Well, there's the woman in red who stared me out and there's that guy that was running as well. Maybe... Maybe it was the guy running. Maybe it wasn't the woman in red. Maybe she's a bit of a red herring, you know? I, I saw a man running. A man on the run. Perhaps it could be an important clue in the case. I'd like to hear more about it at a later date. It's already late today, so go home early. Uh, so you don't want any details right now? You'll wait? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Fair enough. Oh, okay. Yeah, off you pop. Right, I've, I've got to get home, haven't I? Let's see then. Is he? Okay, he, he might be following me. Maybe he's the suspicious person. What the? <laughs> okay, that got me. The doll's gone and the TV, well, it just blew up. <sighs> Maybe that's why it was just left out here. Man, okay. Right. Let's go back home. No one there? No? Okay. What the fuck was that? I don't know if that was the vending machine, the light going out, or, or what. At this point, I just want to leave. Back round to the left. Mm-hmm, okay. Oh. Go, 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 go. I think that's probably her. Why on earth did I choose the guy instead of her? She's the suspicious one. 
All right. Okay. We've got some birds flying around. Quite a few birds, actually. I did see a couple around here the first time when we loaded in. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I guess there's always a second chance of that jump scare. No? It hasn't happened yet. And it won't. Look at all these birds. What, are they crows? Yeah, it probably doesn't bode too well. Uh, okay. Uh, this one here, wasn't it? Yeah, number four. Okay. Okay. So again, let's get the lights on and let's... Let's see. I never thought there was a murder in my neighborhood. I don't want to go down that road again. Hmm. I'm hungry. <laughs> okay. I wonder if there's something in the fridge. We'll check. We will definitely check. As soon as I've got all the lights on. I want to make sure there's no one here. Can we please close these? No. Right. Okay. All right, let's see what's in the fridge. Do I want any of this? No? I suppose that's the freezer, really. Okay. Hmm. Um. Maybe I should just ignore that. Yeah, there we go. Wait, is there a... Ah, I might be able to see outside without opening it. Oh, there's no one there. Hmm. Right. But if there's no one there, where did they go? <laughs> Alright. Wow, okay. Uh, my stomach was full. <laughs> I bet it was, chowing down like that. It's time to go to sleep. Yes, it is. But we can't close these. Never mind. I can't go to sleep? Is it because the light's on? It didn't matter the first time. Maybe it's because the fridge is open. Right. There we go. Hmm. So, light off. There we go. Good stuff. Right. Let's see. Who is it? Again, there's no one there. Weird. What? Ah! Okay, there is someone there. Hold on. Can I have another look? Oh, no, God! Oh! Hi! Right. What's it for? I ask. Are you a recent resignee? What? Uh, yes, that's right, apparently. Uh, who are you? You'd better be careful. I've seen a strange woman standing in front of the door a few times. It was very creepy, so I thought I should tell you about it. That's it. See you soon. Not too soon, I hope. Oh, oh all right. Oh, so that's my neighbour who likes to phase through doors. Fine, fine, right. Close the door. Lock it, if you can. Can you do that? I don't think you can. Uh, yeah. Lights off. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, lights on! <laughs> oh, it was one of those crows. <sighs> okay, yeah. Lights on. Lights definitely on. Can we get to sleep now? I'm going to bed already. Good luck with that. I don't think I'd sleep, honestly. No? We're going back in time? Three days ago? Ah, okay. Maybe a slightly different perspective? Who's this? Oh, that's the guy that ran past me, right? Hello, he says. You. Did you work overtime today? Yes. I've been busy with work lately. 
Uh, my neighbour, I think, right? Yeah. I won't be able to go home on time this month, he says. More than that, what did you do? It's so rare for you to call me. What's going on? I have an important story to tell you, she says. I want to talk to you at home, so come home soon. Mysterious. Hmm. And is that why he was running? Or was that after he went home? Hmm. Alright. Uh, I'm home, apparently. And apparently I need to decorate. Is my wife already sleeping? So we're now playing as him going home. Okay, it really is a different perspective. It's also very dark. Thankfully, though, I've got a flashlight, too. Alright, let's see. Okay. Honey? <laughs> What's all this about a story? Hmm. Looks like there's a couple of teas or coffees down there. That wasn't me, was it? No. I heard someone. My wife? Presumably? Maybe she is upstairs, but let's check out the ground floor first. Okay. Maybe in here? No. No, I think she might be upstairs. Right, yeah, okay, she's not taking a bath or anything. Maybe she is in bed. Maybe she just climbed into bed. That's that's what I heard. Uh-huh. Okay. Let's go from the left to right. Oh, it's locked. Okay. Is it usually locked, I wonder? So is that one? And that one too. The hell? Oh. Oh, that's... It's usually not covered in blood, I assume. Right. Um, maybe we need to find a key. Down... Did that come from downstairs? That must have come from downstairs. I am quite nervous playing this. This is very rough around the edges. It's like a, a sort of first draft of a Chiller's art game, it feels like, but it's pretty good so far. No one in there? No. The blood wasn't on the floor a moment ago, was it? Can we just get out of here? Maybe that's the smart decision. No? Okay. Of course we can't get out of here, because it's the smart decision. Oh, there's more blood back there, too. Alright. And one of the mugs is gone. Honey? I think at this point I can confidently say that these people are the murdered couple, right? Which doesn't bode too well for me. If my wife was first, then I'm next. Right. Ooh. I am definitely not alone here. Oh, oh, bloody hell. That, that sounded really, really close, but it's not this door. Oh, okay. Right. Maybe it was a door upstairs? Yeah, it could have been a door from upstairs. Let's see. Oh man, there's even more blood now. Still locked. There's still lots. Oh no, no! Oh my god! This place really is a bloodbath! And... Is, is that her? Oh no. 
kidding me? No, no one's getting you. Jeez. Anyone hiding in the closet? No? Wait. I'm pressing right click. My flashlight. It, it's not working. It just died. Perfect timing! Right. Um... We... Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, close the door. Can we hide? <laughs> Can we open that closet now? No? Oh boy. Oh shit. Okay. Right, so it is definitely her that we need to worry about. Right, we're back playing as the student. Who could have visited me at this hour? Well, let's go and find out, shall we? Let's get those lights on. There we go. Yeah, all of them. There we are. Oh dear, it's her. It's actually her. Right, yeah, I am not opening the door. Sorry, try somewhere else. No. I can't look through, and I can't open the door even if I wanted to. That woman is crazy. I have to call the police. Good idea. Very good idea, okay. He said it would take two minutes for the police to arrive. Okay. I have to endure it for another two minutes. Oh, it's only two minutes, that's not bad. Go away, alright? Let's get these lights on. Okay. And can we really not... Can we really not close the curtains? I was about to ask. Uh, apparently not. I am not going anywhere near that window. Let's try that again. How the hell did she get around that quick? Ah, okay. So we don't have to play through too much again. Right, so two minutes. Only two minutes, but that two minutes might be a bit of a challenge, actually. <laughs> okay, right. I'm not going anywhere near that window. Um, shall I go in here? Right. Yeah, I might just hide in here. Whoa, oh, jeez! She smashes the window, then very calmly comes in. Oh. Right. I, I think I'm gonna stay here and just hope for the best. Wait, is she, has she gone? She might have left. There she is. Right. Okay. Uh, what do I do? What do I do? Can I do anything? Shall I just continue to hide? My hearing is exquisite, by the way. I can hear her from all the way over there. Maybe she's gone down. Maybe I'm safe. Right, close the door. Close the door. Um, can't do much about that. We can't do much about the birds outside either, I suppose. Oh, I'm not going to hop over to my neighbours or anything. Right, I, honestly, all I need to do is survive for another 30 seconds. This has served me pretty well. I'm just going to stand here. Or, I don't know, maybe... No, I'm going to I'm gonna cower in the corner. It does sound like she's getting closer again. Oh, shit! Don't open the door. Do not open the door. I guess she heard me. Okay, three, two, one. Alright. Wow, on the dot. Two minutes exactly. I'm impressed. Right. Is it safe? Ooh. <laughs> The woman fled before the police arrived. I don't know why she attacked me. A week has passed since then, but the woman has not been caught yet. It seems like I hear those footsteps every night. It's so creepy that I've decided to move out in the near future. I just hope they catch her soon. 
in the near future. Move out now. Like, immediately. Oh? Oh, there's more. I can't move. She's coming back. Hi again. <laughs> Please don't kill me. Bad end? Wait, what? Bad end? Wait, there's a good and a bad ending. Okay. Um, well, she she wasn't caught, I suppose, but I survived, so it's not it's not a terrible ending, but it's still a bad ending. What do you need to do for the good ending, I wonder? Let's go in and see if we can get a good ending, shall we? Run, 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 run. Oh, the oh, bloody hell. She is fast. Insanely fast. But apparently, to get the good ending, you need to go outside, so I guess you do need to outrun her. What? Oh, is that doll? Oh! Oh, I've got myself a sledgehammer! Right. Okay. I guess now I've got the means to defend myself, but I don't know if I actually trust myself to attack her and time it right so that she doesn't kill me. There she is. Oh boy, oh boy! Oh! Wow! Okay! Oh, and the, the police arrive early this time! Okay, did I kill her? Just knock her out? Maybe they can actually arrest her? Alright. Well, surely that's the good ending, right? The police arrived shortly thereafter. The woman died. Self-defense was admitted, and I was not caught. It turned out that the murderer of the couple was the woman. She had a former affair with her husband, who was killed in the incident. The police speculated that she committed the murders out of spite. A month after the incident, I moved out. I never want to feel like that again. And I don't blame you. All right, good end. So I got the bad ending and the good ending to Akai Honor. Thank you very much for watching. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments, like or dislike the video, all right? What did you think? I thought this was all right. A little bit better than average, yeah. It wasn't brilliant, but it wasn't bad at all. It did feel, you know, flawed. It did feel a little bit rough and unrefined, let's say. There could be some tweaks here and there to make it a better experience. It felt like a sort of a rough first draft of a Chiller's Art game. In good and bad ways, you know? It was quite creepy. I was filled with paranoia throughout most of the game. Uh, and that jump scare by the window, man, that really got to me. It was alright. Yeah, it was alright. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Right. Well, that was kind of weird. Oh boy, right. Huh. Okay, yeah, I'm tired. I'm going to bed today. <laughs> As opposed to all the other days where I don't go to bed. I don't see this mysterious lady in red. Not this time. Ooh. Then again, maybe I'm hearing her. <laughs> I can tell by the look on your face. You can see my face? Wearing your hat like that? I'm impressed. He might be following me. Maybe he's the suspicious person. <laughs> what the- <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Lights off. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, lights on! <laughs> still locked. Oh, they're still locked. Oh, no, no! Oh, my God! Oh, shit. Oh. And can we really not... Oh, did the oh, bloody hell! Oh, boy, oh, boy! Oh, wow!